understand some of you guys go to private senior high school why would you go to private senior high school while there is a government saying how can you jump to it to break your business like welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel if i knew you hi i'm nanabna if you're not hi welcome or welcome back to so yeah as you guys can see from today's title i'm going to be sharing you guys my experiences my first day in senior high school i know like this video is kind of late to do but never late i'm better i forgot the quote but it says something like that you see it's better to do it late than never yeah so whilst i'm telling you guys my stories in senior high school i'm also going to be reading to you guys like yours reading to you guys your stories what you experienced in senior high school blah blah so if that's what I do let's get right into the video so i went to school yeah i'm currently in in what yeah i'm from two like i'm in from two so i went to school on the 22nd of april even though school resumed on is this 7th april yeah but i didn't go because you all can't tell me what to do <laughs> so yeah i went on that day and oh really it was a friday yeah so when i went to school my mom sent me because like my dad is always busy he doesn't have time sent me when i got to the school i didn't really like the school though but right now i love my school so much per so yeah, when we go, oh, I, I might like this place. Like, I might, that was just like the feeling that I was having and things like that. So my mom, after packing our means, registered, getting a room, get a house, do back and everything and everything. Yeah, my mom was like, she was going. And I already got a friend in that school. So I wasn't really that star. My mom, me in the school or something like that. Because I'm a big girl. I'm a big so yeah my mom left me there she gets me kisses and all that all that and everything so yeah my friend uh where do they offer like what is the block for this course because in the school like a week before I came you know late game so she was like oh this place doing this introduction thing you know come and introduce yourself your name and myself I don't know how to introduce myself so yeah we did it and everything everything so it was close it and since I was like fresh People will carry my thing for me. So yeah, they carried my room. Like, eh, sorry. They carried my bags, my trunk, and everything to the room for me. Oh, like, the dorm was really nice. It wasn't to my expectation, but yeah, we can manage. So yeah, we went to my thing. A little all the way, like, for prep and everything. So after prep, that was when I started feeling lonely there. Like, I'm all alone here in this new place. I miss my mom. What could they be doing by? Right? I heard something like it's hiring around is it five or four something like that four thirty, and that was when my struggles began because yo I couldn't get out from top bed to be honest like, and I wanted to pee so bad like I wanted to pee so bad so I was just there you know just checking 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 if someone would wake up to come and help me get out from top bed because I wanted to pee so bad I might pee on myself. So I was just there at the top, pray, 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 until yeah, someone woke up, and that was the first friend. Let me see, like second friend I made in high school. So she helped me get down, time to bath, and that was when I realized the bathroom, like it was very huge, and you all have to bath inside the bathhouse. And I was like, this isn't what I sought for, because I can't imagine myself bathing with somebody, because my whole life. I've not bathed with somebody. So right now, like, do I need to do that? So yeah, that was when I first shed tears. Because I felt I was alone and everything and everything here. Yeah. Something like, you know, the this thing that they do for you guys, showing you guys the school and how the school looks like and everything and everything. Yeah, we had it. And that was when the struggles began to work. It was like you, you would scrub. You will sweep before you go to class. You wake up early. You sweep. You go to class. Like everything, every struggle thing. So yeah, that was when the baby means that they wake up. 
I started crying and things because of the pain. But above all, it was such a great experience in like boarding house and everything. But now I'm fixed to be like it's part of me right now. I wouldn't cry again because right now I'm Odogu. I'm Odogu Sha. Yeah. So yeah, I'm going to read it to you guys some of your stories. I have another. It is on my phone. I have another phone here, which I'm reading to you guys. So yeah, the third year is always sending you as soon as she gets to the door. And when you don't go, you are finished. For my school like this, they wouldn't force you to go. If you don't want to go, go. You just tell them like you just don't want to go. So when the seniors ask you to scrub or sleep and then you tell them you can't, they start asking you for your doctor's report. Yeah, people like lie a lot about this thing. They'll be like, oh, they are sick, they are ill. The doctor said this, the doctor said that. I'm not supposed to do this, I'm not supposed to do that. But you all, like, we all do that. Because the work is too much. You bab, yeah. You just tell them, like, you just don't want to go. So when the seniors ask you to scrub or sleep and then you tell them you can't. They start asking you for your doctor's report. Yeah, people like lie a lot about this thing. They'll be like, oh, they are sick, they are ill. The doctor said this, the doctor said that. I'm not supposed to do this, I'm not supposed to do that. But you all, like, we all do that. Because the work is too much. You bab, yeah. School one time, it was time to leave the house for prep and I was asleep. Then my housemaster came to cause some scatter in the school. Hey, I had to jump the back gate and the way the gate to is, I almost broke my virginity. Like, the person is exaggerating. How can you jump a gate to break your virginity? Like, how can you tell me this? How can you, how can you tell me this? But then, attending a boarding school in Ghana is, is a great experience, except the stressful part where you have to wake up early work get ready go to class come work again preps and all that stuff and the food huh but it's a great experience but for real i don't understand some of you guys go to private senior high school why would you go to a private senior high school while there is a government senior high school in ghana here just experience the fun and everything to meet great people and things but yeah, I think this is where I'll end my video. I'll see you guys in my next video. Maybe next week or maybe this week or maybe not. Maybe not. Because I'm your inconsistent babe. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Thank you for watching. Chop kiss.